Me with the universe is a pretty powerful force. Me with you in the universe is a pretty powerful force. All of us with the universe behind us is an undominatable force. We have this opportunity regularly to reveal who we are. I'm paying attention to what's coming down and I'm going to reveal what that is. And I have discovered one of the greatest things people want in their life is to be seen and heard. Has anybody else heard that? I just want to be heard. If someone just sees me, I feel valued. But then the counterpoint of that is, but I don't want to be seen and heard and then make a mistake and feel bad. So there's this internal battle that happens in people. I really want to be myself, I want to be heard, I want to be seen, but it's a little frightening because if I am seen and heard and I do it in a way that I'd like to apologize for, now I've got all this shame. So I'd like to free the gate of shame and fear and call in the support of all those who want to do this together knowing we're all going to make mistakes. Knowing that we are all going to do this with limit, the limitations we have today that we will learn about as we do it. Because this country can be great again. Sunrise Ranch is great and can have a great influence in the world. And the mission, which is that humanity is restored, can, this is my we. This is my family. This can be wholesome again because I say I will, I will be present, and I will support you as you are present, and we will do something magnificent together, knowing I'm not a Democrat or a Republican. I am an angel and a daughter of God, and so are you, a daughter or son of God, part of humanity that's conscious and saying, I will. And I would invite us, as we are together online, in person, in this planet, to, to realize we are the ones holding the space for that which could come down into our enlightened mind and our yielded heart for a potential future that's very different than our rugged past, ragged past, dysfunctional past. There's also been wonderful things that have happened, but when we in, when I stand in this position, knowing how many years this building has been used as a place to bring a message of possibility for the human experience to be totally different than it has been based on choice, but to participate in our lives in, in this position, you know, of what are we doing consciously together so that the world can be all that it can be because we're here. We are the ones. Anyone who's got their hands up is, is ready to serve and pay attention to what's possible. What is possible instead of what has failed? What are we going to choose for the rest of our lives? And have we, in fact, forgotten that we can consciously choose to keep our focus in one direction or another? And how we could deliberately change it all by saying, let's take a moment and get up there and now see what's coming down from the place where possibility and newness and wholesomeness is our orientation. Because we all have the choice to do that, and to do that together would be um, a change of the whole world pattern. I am an American, but I'm also a citizen of this planet, citizen of this world, citizen of this universe, citizen of the kingdom. And I take responsibility for bringing the government, the government of holiness and truth and compassion and support and honesty and forgiveness, solidarity, kindness. It's available to any conscious being who says yes. We just have to remember where it comes from.